Hi, I'm Michael Newrock, and in this lesson, we're going to go over moving averages and crossovers. Now, this is a really important concept. Uh, it's at the heart of Trend Profiteer as far as our uh, signal entry system goes. So let's bring up a moving average. Um, now we have two already on the chart, but I'll bring up oops, a new moving average. So let's make it a 100 bar. Lime green is the color. Yeah, um, I'm not going to go into this too much. You can have different types of moving averages, simple, exponential, smooth, and linear weighted. We stick with simple, and you can apply uh, the moving average can be uh, based on the close, which is how we have it, but you can also have it on uh, on different, um, you can apply it to, to different points, so the open, the high, low, and so forth. But it's easiest and simplest just to leave it a simple close. So we'll just click OK, and you can see here that this bar, this, this line here, is giving us a mathematical representation that at this point right now, uh, this is the average of where price has been over the last 100 bars. So let's have a look. If we go back to the last 100 bars, to it's about here. There's 100. Okay, so it's a little bit lower. Want to just bring that up again? 100 bars. Okay, so there's been a move of 180 pips over the last 100 bars. We can see the price here, um, and over this last 100 bars, okay, to here, we've got um, these the price on these candles being lower than the current price, and the price up here being higher than the uh, current price, and that's how the moving average is, uh, is determined. So let's say this point here is the representation on the chart of what the price has been on average over the last 100 bars. Okay, so I'll just delete that now. In the Trend Profiteer system, we rely on two moving averages, the uh, seven uh, moving average of the 7MA and the 21, the 21MA. So if we open in either of these up, we can see that. Okay, so simple close, seven bar moving average. That's all there is to it. And same with this one. This is a 21 bar moving average. Uh, now, the important thing is that when they cross over, uh, like you can see here, the yellow crosses over the gray moving average that's considered a moving average crossover we can see it happen here again uh, you can see that failed um, now this technically wouldn't have actually been a valid trade we're not going to get into that right now but I just want you to get used to seeing these moving average crossovers so here's another one to the upside um, we can see one here that went uh, nicely um, we've been overall in an upward uh, move so uh, you can see this one didn't go very well but the, my point is that you know over this time the moving average crossovers to the upside have been very um, successful because the price has been moving up we've got a consolidation zone here and we've had it zigzag fine so it's a little messy but finally we did get the moving average crossover to the upside and we can see that uh, that went extremely well so that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, we rely on two moving averages on uh, the Trend Profiteer system to provide the uh, moving average crossover. Now, obviously, there are a lot more indicators on the Trend Profiteer system, as you've already seen, but you know this gives you the the, the basics of uh, of uh, moving averages and uh, their crossover, which provides the uh, signal entry if all the other indicators are in alignment. Uh, and uh, that concludes this lesson. Until next time, good trading, live well, and I'll see you soon.